Biggest honors of all time. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It is. Just a nomination and the energy from these people here. The moments before his historic win, Hollywood saying goodbye to legendary actor Lou Gossett Jr. This is him in Louisville speaking at the Chestnut YMCA at the Black Achievers Award ceremony back in 1993. His family says he died Thursday in Santa Monica, California. And Gossett is best known for his award-winning roles, of course, in Roots and in An Officer and a Gentleman, which earned him a Best Supporting Actor Oscar. He was the first black man to achieve that honor. ABC's Tim Pulliam has more on his life and his legacy. Louis Gossett Jr., the first black man to win an Oscar for Best Supporting Actor, has died. Understand? Yes, sir. It was his captivating performance as the intimidating Marine drill instructor in an officer and a gentleman that earned him that historic win. Wouldn't take too long shooing that horse if I was you. Gossett also broke through on television, receiving an Emmy for his portrayal as Fiddler in the groundbreaking 1977 miniseries Roots. The actor, who was raised in Brooklyn, said in his 2010 memoir that it was his English teacher who urged him to pursue theater. He made his Broadway debut in 1953 at the age of 16. His most recent film credit was in last year's remake of The Color Purple, playing the father to actor Coleman Domingo. Domingo posting this video on Instagram of him alongside actress Fantasia thanking Gossett following his last day on set. We thank you for For years after his Oscars win, Gossett said he struggled with alcohol and cocaine addiction, eventually going to rehab. In 1992, he received a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. How would you like to be remembered? To be remembered as Louis Gossett Jr., who could be Superman too. During a 2018 interview with the Television Academy, Gossett sharing a personal moment when he was 12, feeling discouraged about what he could become because of the color of his skin, until a childhood friend said otherwise. Hey, what are you talking about? You're Superman today. He had no idea what he said. That worry went out of my mind at the age of 12, and I was Superman, the best Superman on the block. Gossett was treated years ago for prostate cancer and in 2020 was hospitalized with COVID-19. His family has not released the cause of death. He leaves behind two adult sons. Tim Pulliam, ABC News, Los Angeles. Well, Taylor Hackford, who directed Gossett in An Officer and a Gentleman, says his Oscar-winning role was originally written for a hmm. white actor. Hackford says he met Gossett Jr., who had served in the Army and hired him right on the spot.